Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a deep clean with me in my bedroom and as you can see it really, really needs it. So the first thing I'm going to start off by doing is taking off and stripping the bed. Uh, Lily threw up on it this morning. I scrubbed it of course um, when she did it but the sheets probably haven't been washed for a good week and a half, two weeks anyway, so they really did need a good clean. And I feel like when I'm tidying my room, if I don't change the bed sheets, then I really don't feel like the room's been tidied at all. <laughs> why my pillows are so yellow like they're not even that old they've just gone really yellow and I'm pretty sure I cannot remember me all down sleeping on these pillows without the cases um, but I just put all of this straight in the wash using the linen fresh so flora I actually used the last of it in this video and I just put it on a quick spin which is only 50 15 minutes um, it's really not that dirty we don't have food upstairs and all the sick was removed this morning so a quick wash is all it needs Lily was also napping this evening which made me cleaning a little bit more easier so this big pile of clothes I have on the floor I just pick up and just slung it all on the bed and uh, yeah I just this is the main thing that triggered me to do my room <laughs> Once everything's up on my bed, I start to make piles. Now I have a pile for me. I normally have about three piles for myself. I have a pile for like bed linen and towels. I have Dana pile. I have the underwear a pile. And I also have a pile for Lilith shock. I know. Um, but yeah, I just throw it all into their own piles because I feel like if I don't, then I don't really know what I'm doing. And I find the whole thought process of doing it really overwhelming and it really does put me off organizing the clothes if I don't put it into separate piles. It might look like I'm throwing stuff on the floor. I can promise you now that I'm not. I have my pajama box right near my bedside table when I was doing this on the floor because I couldn't fit all my pajamas in my wardrobe as well. So I need a pajama box and they're all just going straight into there. There's no kind of organization to that box. You just kind of put your piles on top of what's already in there. I then bring my big pink Ikea bag, which has also got some nice clean washing in. I love my Ikea bag. And if you go to Ikea, buy one for this purpose because it's so easy to transport washing I clean wash it from downstairs all the way upstairs in this bag because it's got big handles, it's a big bag, it's an absolute godsend. I then go into the linen cupboard and just try and sort out and bring out the bed sheets that I need to put on the bed. Um, both of these cupboards that you're seeing really do need a bit of work, but I just haven't got the time right now and because they're closed doors, I'm not really that bothered. So then I just sort out all the dirty laundry on the bedroom floor. I don't know why we accumulate all of our clothes, dirty clothes, into the bedroom because we have a laundry bin downstairs. And I don't know why me and Dan just can't take our stuff downstairs. Uh, I can't just blame him because I do it myself and a lot of it is mine. Um, I'm also putting all the kind of underwear and socks into a mesh bag because I'm sick and tired of losing socks in the washing machine. So they're all going in a bag. It's fine to go in the washing machine. So. I figured what's the heart. So here is an overview of all my piles. I have Dan's shirts in a separate pile, my clothes and my everyday wear in a separate pile. I have them in two separate piles. The towels and just big fluffy pajama jumpers in a separate pile. And then there's my bag full of socks and stuff. And here is the mound of washing that I need to organize on my bed. So it's already 20 to nine and I still haven't done anything. And I'm probably the only one that does this, but I pull the curtain back and when I'm putting all my clothes on the hanger instead of taking them straight to the wardrobe, I just hang them up on the curtain rail instead and then sort them up that way. Does anyone else do it or is it just me? Hey, 
said Lilith has joined us. I finally got my laundry body back. She has woken up. She is my favourite person to have with me when I'm doing this because she just laughs at herself and she's always so happy and I love her so much. I don't know. So as you can probably see by everything I'm hanging up, I mainly have a wardrobe full of jumpers. No matter if it's winter or summer, I'm always in a jumper. And yeah, I really need to get out of that habit. So then I just put all of Dan's stuff into his wardrobe for him. Aren't I a good girlfriend? And then I go back into the bedroom and sort out all of mine as well. And my wardrobe probably doesn't look it. I'll give you a quick overview in a minute. But it is actually quite organised. And yeah, it's in like t-shirts, outwear and jumpers. And in the bottom of the screen, you can probably see my daughter's foot just kicking around, which is so cute. So here is that quick overview I was on about and at the bottom I have stuff like leggings, jogging bottoms, jeans, so it's actually pretty organised and I, I like it. Um, so now I'm just taking off all the extra bits that are left on the bed. Uh, I've got stuff like Lily's clothes as well that need going into her room and I'm just sorting out the bed just so I can make it. I feel like no matter what I do I've always got something left over on my bed. So I'm going to start by putting off, putting my cushions in the pillowcases, my pillows in the pillowcases, I never know what they're called. Um, and I'm also going to need to move Lilith because I, because I cannot put a sheet on my bed with her laying where she is, but she's just cute, I love her. I'm also probably going to wake her by speaking right now.
So I've actually thrown the duvet you would have seen earlier away. Um, it was a really crap duvet. It was a really weird kind of feel as well. It was quite heavy, but at the same time, it didn't keep it very warm. So I've thrown it away. I had a separate one when we moved. Um, I had two different types, and this is the better one. I don't know why I put that other one out on my bed, or even kept it. Um, and I've also got two pillowcase, uh, two pillows that I completely forgot about that need to go in there as well. give you a quick overview of my room now it's all clean i love it when it's clean i don't know why i can't keep it like this all the time i hope you've enjoyed this video if you have be sure to subscribe and i'll see you on my next video bye